Yes, it's about to go down. Southern fried corn and fat back. This is one of my favorites from my mama. Okay, to make fried skillet corn, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put my fat back in some water. I have rinsed it off. We are going to allow this fat back to boil for 15 minutes, okay? So let's go ahead and let's allow this to boil for 15 minutes. But first, make sure you wash, rinse it off, rinse that salt off about two times. After you have boiled your fat back for 15 minutes, go ahead and drain it, damp it off with a paper towel, place it in your um, skillet or pan that you're gonna cook it in the oven with. I'm cooking mine in my large cast iron skillet and this is what we will be frying the corn in. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna place this fat back in the oven. Into the oven we go, 350 degrees. Okay, so our fat bat is done. It's fried and it's crispy, y'all. That's how you want it. Mm-hmm. And we have a shallow amount of oil and that's all you need, okay? So go ahead and remove your fat bat. We're going to put it back in now, okay? But I'm taking it. And I'm going to put it to the side. You don't have to drain the oil off this because that's what we need to make this dish. This is southern fried fat back, fried corn and fat back, okay? This is one of my favorite recipes that my mother used to make. Okay, so use the oil that is made from your fried fat back, okay? You only need a shallow amount at the bottom. You don't need a lot, okay? So you can see the shallow amount in my cast iron skillet. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to add my corn, okay? You can use fresh corn. You can use canned corn, okay? Don't let nobody tell you, ah, hey, it's canned corn. You can use canned corn to make this recipe. Take it from somebody down south. Yes, my mother used fresh corn most of the time, but you can use canned corn. So what you're going to do is you're going to start to toss the corn in the oil. Okay? And you're actually going to do this for about 15 minutes, okay? And while you toss tossing that corn in there to make this recipe, you're going to go in, you're going to add you some onions. Okay? Here I have a half of a small onion. I'm going to throw in some red bell pepper and some green bell pepper, okay? We're going to toss this around. Mix that all in there together. Get that oil on everything, okay? And cook this on a medium heat because you're frying it in that oil. Okay, now we are going to add some seasoning to this. I'm going to tell you which one of these seasoning going to be your best friend. It's the black pepper. Yes, that's right. For this recipe, southern fried corn with fat back, the black pepper is going to make your dish, okay? If you ain't got no black pepper in it, then you ain't got no dish. Now, don't put too much in it, but you need to put enough, okay? We're not going to use any salt because remember that pork is salted. That salted pork. Fried fat back is salted pork. Okay? So just add just a little bit of that slap your mama seasoning. And that's what I'm using. Okay? If you want to use something else, you can. Like Larry. Okay? Now let's go ahead and let's stir that together. And I'm going to allow this to um, fry. Well, I'm going to add my butter in here, y'all. I forgot to go ahead and add my butter. I'm going to go ahead and add my butter. 
Now, because of the size of the skillet that I got, I'm going to use a half a stick of butter, okay? And it can be unsalted butter if you have it. If you don't, go ahead and just use what you got. Okay, so I'm going to allow this to fry for 15 minutes, y'all. And I'll be back in 15 minutes. Okay, so to this, I'm going to add some flour. I'm not going to add the liquid yet. I'm just going to add some flour. That's about, for this size skillet, which is big, that's about four tablespoons of flour, okay? And you're going to stir that in. You're going to allow that flour to cook like you would when you're making a gravy, okay? Just mix it up in that corn. You're not going to let it turn like a deep brown. You just want to cook it off for about two minutes. Get it on out of corn because when you get ready to pour your milk in, it's going to help thicken it up, okay? going to help thicken it up. Okay, I'm going to turn the eye down a little lower. You scrape that goodness up off the bottom of your skillet, okay? This is a real southern skillet corn right here. Okay, so now what we're going to do, before I add my sugar and stuff, I'm going to go ahead and add in some milk. Here I have milk and I add a little chicken bouillon powder. We try to get some flavor in here, okay? And this is about two cups of milk, okay? It just depends on the size of the skillet that you use. Okay, so now let's put that in there. We're gonna mix that all together. Because we're going to have to allow this to cook for about 15 to 20 more minutes, okay? Now, but to this, we're going to go ahead, we're going to add just a little bit of sugar, okay? Not a lot, just a little. And that's about a tablespoon of sugar. Now you see how that flour helping it thicken up? Because that's exactly how it's supposed to look. Now what we're going to do, we're going to add a small amount of water to this. Just a little bit. Just a damn. Not too much. Probably about one third cup of water. We're not going to cook this corn to where it's not crunchy. You got to have a little crunch to it to be fried skillet corn, okay? And it is supposed to look creamy. And now what we're going to do, we're going to take a spoon and you're going to taste it to see if you need to add any more seasoning. Mm. Yeah, I'm going to add a little more black pepper. Add a little more of that sloppy mama seasoning, y'all. And we're going to add in our... Um, Fried fat back. Okay. Don't go heavy with that sugar. Make sure you just put a pinch of sugar in there. About a tablespoon or a half a tablespoon. Okay. So now what we're finna do, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna add in this. Fried fat back. Now, some of y'all I know using bacon, but we add that fried fat back in and that grease. Now, this is how you make real southern fried corn. Mm -hmm. It is so good. Okay, we're going to allow this to cook. This um, fat back will get a little soft. Cook this for about 15 to 20 minutes. And I'll be back when it's done. Okay, everyone, so our fried skillet corn is done. See that? This is how you make southern fried skillet corn. Okay, with fried fat back. Salted pork, baby. 
I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial on how to make skillet corn with fried fat back. Stay tuned to Cooking with TK for another video. Peace. Have a great day.